That was the Brooklyn Tabernacle Choir with, of course, it's Christmas time again. Well, it's time for us to go to prayer. So whether your need is physical, spiritual, emotional, intellectual, financial, or family, I want you to know today that even before the request is out of your mouth, the answer is already on the way. So Lord, thank you today. Now, today we want to focus on the fact that you are Jehovah Jireh. We know that Lord, out there right now, rising prices and cities are putting heavier taxes on people and just Everywhere we look, Lord, we're dealing with insecurity and also, Lord, inflation. And we ask that, Lord, right now, and, and we understand that our wages haven't gone up the way inflation has. But there's one promise that you have given us from Philippians chapter 4, verse number 19. And it's simply this, that you're going to supply every need according to your riches and glory. It's the end of the month. And we're kind of looking at our bills and we see our mortgage payments and we see, Lord, the rent and all the other things that are sitting right in front of us. And we wonder, Lord, where is it all going to come from? And when's it going to end? Well, Father, we know one thing. This has been historically a problem. <laughs> but you have had the answer historically and today. And so, Lord, thank you that you are Jehovah Jireh, our provider. That means that you're going to supply every need according to your riches and glory. In fact, we learned yesterday that in James 1.17 that... Every good and perfect gift comes down from the Father of lights. And the one thing that we learn in that promise and blessing and benefit is that, Lord, there's no shadow of turning, no variable. You are consistent and constant. And so, Lord, we are just simply claiming that today in the name of Jesus. And we're grateful. Also as well, Lord, we're going to take a moment right now and pray for healing. Lord, thank you today for 1 Peter 2.24 and Isaiah 53 verse number 5 that says, by your stripes we're healed. So Lord, right now, wherever we find ourselves today and whatever situation we find ourselves in today, Lord, you are our healer. And not just ourselves, but Lord, for the people that we're praying for, for our family and friends. That is a wonderful promise that we have today from your word. And we're grateful for that. One final thing, Lord, would you order our steps today? Would you lead and guide and direct us throughout this day? We need you consistently and constantly, Lord, every moment of this day. And we have a wonderful promise found in Matthew chapter 28, verse number 20, that says, you're always with us. You never leave us nor forsake us. And that is absolutely wonderful. So, Lord, we're just going to thank you for all of these things. In your name we pray, Jesus. Amen.